loves welcome back to my channel today I'm sharing with you guys a spring inspired haul from Rue 21 you guys actually requested to see a video from them so that is what I'm bringing to you guys today I did place an order online I have a ton of different stuff um, from tops to bottoms I have uh, some skirts I have uh, some dresses I have some accessories um, some tees I have a pair of jeans it's just gonna be super fun haul I don't actually have a Rue 21 close by to me so I do often forget about them so I do appreciate you guys just suggesting to shop there because they did have some really really awesome pieces online when I placed my order they had a deal like buy one get one half off on certain items and then there was also something like you spent a hundred and you got like 40 off or something like that um, if there's any deals going on I'll link them in the description box down below I do believe I actually got a coupon in my order so I'll put that information down below if you guys are interested um, as always I will have everything listed in the description box down below including a link to shop and my size in case you guys are interested we'll talk about prices we'll talk about the quality the fit um, I'll try everything on for you guys as always but before we get started with this video I do want to just talk to you guys really really quick um, so as some of you guys may know I've mentioned a few times on my channel here and there but I do have my eyebrows microbladed um, I got my eyebrows done almost a year and a half ago I believe or like closer to two years so it's definitely been a while and they do need to be touched up um, so I am actually going the day when you guys are seeing this video I'm going later that evening to get my eyebrows touched up um, so you guys have like I said you've asked me a lot of questions about it so I am gonna go ahead and film the entire experience and post it on YouTube but let me know in the comments below if you guys have any questions or anything that you would like me to specifically discuss during my visit to get my eyebrows done like I said I'm gonna film everything you guys will see that probably in the next week or so um, but if you guys have any questions or anything specific you would like me to talk about during the video definitely let me know I probably have already asked this on Instagram as well but if you guys have any additional questions in the comments and I'll be sure to answer them for you guys but anyway if you guys are interested in seeing this rear 21 haul then please keep watching okay you guys so my idea for this haul was definitely to put pieces together to make some outfits I feel like sometimes I don't I don't always share with you guys ways to wear them so I thought it would be fun to kind of put pieces together and show you how I would personally wear them the first piece I'm super excited to share with you guys I actually got a pair of jeans these are the plus white high-waisted destroyed denim I guess the again they're in color in the color white they're in a size 14 and I only paid $27.96 now again there were some sales going on when I placed my order so prices may be different but everything will be listed in the description box below but this is what the jeans look like here so as mentioned they are a pair of white denim they are high rise jegging they fit right at the belly button which is kind of what I prefer they do have traditional front and, and back pockets um, the front pockets I'll say are like smaller if that makes sense so they're not super deep I mean it's not like a huge deal breaker for me or anything but just keep that in mind um, and there's another pair of pants I have to share with you guys the pockets are that way as well uh, but these do have distressing all over them so some towards the knee a little bit towards the bottom there's up, some up in this pocket over here and then the bottom also has a bit of distressing as well these fit me almost like I want to say like a capri fit I do believe they are meant to be an ankle fit but on me being that I'm 5'10 they do fit me a little bit shorter but I actually don't mind it being that it is um, getting warmer outside I think it's a cute fit I actually wore these jeans already and I can say they're really great the only issue I had with them was they're stretchy but they do kind of lose their shape throughout the day so i was at um, our nephew's birthday party we were like bending down like running around definitely doing a lot with these white jeans on and they definitely stretched out it wasn't uncomfortable but they did kind of stretch out a bit and when you guys are seeing them in the try on portion unfortunately i'm wearing a darker pair of underwear and i did kind of do that on purpose just so you guys could see how sheer they are um they are on the sheer side which you obviously will see but i did pair them with a nude thong over the weekend when i wore them and you weren't able to see any underwear in, in that way so i'm wearing them again in the try on portion with a black pair of undies but wearing a nude pair of undies really does help i didn't notice anything and my boyfriend is the first one to tell 
tells me if my pants are see-through, he will come at me so quick, like, your pants are see-through, you're going out like that, but he didn't say anything, so I know they were okay. So I really like these jeans, especially for the price point. I think they're awesome. Again, like I said, they just stretch out a little bit, and if you're thinking about picking these up, definitely wear them with some nude undies, and you will be good to go. Now, the top I paired with them was kind of like a last-minute purchase. Like I said in the beginning of the video, uh, Ver 21 was having buy one, get one half off on only certain items. So I needed an extra item to kind of get me to the buy one, get one half off. Like, so it was eligible on another item. Um, but this is the plus red tie dye varsity striped Coke um, in the color red. And it only cost $11.85. And I picked mine up in a size 1X. So I believe pretty much everything is from the plus size section if you guys are interested. So this is what the top looks like here. It is so cute. I actually like, I didn't think I was gonna like the two of them together. Like I said, it was like a last minute kind of idea, but I would totally wear these two together. So it says always Coca-Cola refreshing. And um, it's red tie dye with the writing in red as well. Short sleeve, it does have the varsity stripe detail on the sleeve. And I tied mine in a knot at the bottom. That's the way they had it on the model, um, but it isn't tied like you can untie it if you need to or you want to and just kind of let it flow out whatever you prefer um, it, it's there's enough material at the bottom and it's not already like pre-tied so you can wear it untied if you prefer the next piece I have to share with you guys is a dress for this one I did not find another piece to kind of pair with it it's just the dress um, but I do still have some more outfits I'll share with you guys this is the plus orange floral print flounce high it's in the color burnt orange and I paid $17.13 and this is also in a size 1X. So this is what the dress looks like here. It is absolutely beautiful. You guys know I love this burnt orange color. I talk about it all the time. This is a really awesome piece to kind of wear, not all year round, but I feel like this would be good in the spring, the summer, and also in the fall as well. So it is an off the shoulder dress. It does have the elastic band. It's not the best off the shoulder, if you guys know what I'm saying, like it does kind of slip up in my opinion but it's not the worst but it's not the best um, the bottom of the sleeve is elastic as well and then there are faux buttons on the center of this dress which is nice you don't have to worry about the dress puckering at all I kind of like the idea I like the look of buttons but sometimes I get frustrated with them like busting out and everything so this is a nice detail the waist does a cinch in and this dress is high low so higher in the front and lower in the back and then we do have a beautiful ruffle detail towards the bottom as well really really pretty dress I think this is such a fun fun piece like I said really versatile I think it would actually look even better with a tiny belt in the center um, just to kind of shape your waist even more like a tiny little brown belt I think that would look really cute you could easily wear this with mules like I shared with you guys in the try on I'll link the ones I had on in the try on in the comments down below or in the description box down below you could wear it with a pair of mule, mules um, sandals flip-flops you could even dress it up with some heels or espadrilles drill something like that I just think this is such a fun fun dress and really really beautiful quality for the price point the next piece I have to share with you guys is a top this is the plus white ribbed knit high neck top I guess <laughs> in the color white and this cost $7.56 this is what the top looks like here it is super basic I just needed something easy breezy to go with the next piece I'm going to share with you guys so it is a white ribbed tank top high neck as I mentioned goes up like this um, it's very long too which is great I uh, sometimes you guys know with my height, um, tops are always usually fit me a little bit shorter, but this one is longer. I will say the quality on this one, it's just kind of like meh, like there's nothing really to it. It's fine if you need something basic, like it works, but I don't absolutely love it. I don't, I feel like I have other body suits that are plainer that I probably spent around the same price from like Forever 21. So this one's okay. It's not, I mean, there's nothing exciting to it. It's just kind of a plain white top. But the skirt I paired with it is super cute. This is the Plus Mustard Floral Print Button Down Skirt, I guess is the, um, 
The item description is all cut out, cut off pretty much on all these items, but this is in the color mustard and I paid $16.06 for this one. So this is what the skirt looks like here. It is so, so cute. You guys know I love this beautiful mustard color. It does have florals all over it. It does have the buttons in the center with the elastic waistband. The skirt is very, very short in my opinion, but it's still really cute. Perfect piece for the beach, um, perfect piece to wear if you're shorter than me. Um, and maybe you don't have as much as like hips and booty. It might not be as short on you, so you could totally wear this to the office. I will say I like the white jeans. I'm wearing the same black undies as I mentioned, and this skirt you could definitely see right through them. So just keep that in mind. You could wear uh, maybe a pair of nude undies or some like shorts or something like that, and I think it would be okay, but stay away from dark colors with some of these pieces. Um, the other thing is I wish this skirt had a I had pockets. You guys know I love pockets so, so much, and I am a little disappointed to find out that this one didn't have it, but overall, it is very cute in my opinion. And then keeping with skirts, I actually got the same skirt in the black and white color. So this is the plus black dotted uh, print button down skirt. This is in the color black combo, and this one was also 1606. So this is the exact same skirt as before. This one's just in black and white. I thought this one would be more perfect to wear to work in my opinion, um, but again, the length is just a little too short, or a lot too short, honestly, to wear to work. Um, but it's the same idea with the button front center, um, elastic waistband, and just kind of easy breezy skirt. This one, I didn't notice it to be sheer, especially with the darker color, and um, actually, I like this one a little bit better. You guys know I like mustard typically, but I've been really into uh, polka dots recently, so I think this one is so cute. So this one I did get another little plain top. This one is a little bit brighter though. I tried something different. This is the uh, burnt orange ribbed knit button down. This was $11 and um, I don't know how much I've mentioned the sizes but everything I've shared with you guys so far has been in a size 1x. The jeans were in a size 14 and this top is the only one. I did get it in another color. This one's the only one that's in a size extra large but all sizes will be listed down below. Um, so this is what the top looks like here. As mentioned, it is this burnt orange color. As I already said, I love burnt orange. I think it is so fun. So this one does have the buttons in the center. It is a tank top style top. It does have a bit of a v-neck and it is very cropped. So just keep that in mind. I think it looks really cute tucked in the skirt. And next I have one more dress to share with you guys. This is the Plus Burgundy Duo Floral Print Lace. They're calling it the color burgundy and I paid $17.60. 1713 for this one. So this is what the dress looks like here. I am obsessed with this dress. I think this one, I think the dresses honestly were my favorite picks from this haul, but be sure to let me know what your favorites were in the comments down below. But this is what the dress looks like. So it is a v-neck style dress. It does have the crisscross detail in the back. These straps are super stretchy and they are also adjustable so you can adjust them how you prefer. There are also padding in the cups of this dress. The top is super lacy, very pretty. The, the center is this cream color crochet detail with the cutout so you do get show a little bit of tummy with this one which I think is so cute and then at the bottom it is burgundy with the florals all over it I really really love this dress I think it is so incredibly figure flattering it is short of course all of these pieces kind of seem to be but I still think it's really cute I think this is going to look great with some espadrilles like a big hat and maybe a straw bag or something like that like this is definitely like summer vibes to me like I love it and the last I outfit I have to share with you guys I have another one of the tanks that I shared with you guys in the burgundy color this is the black ribbed knit button down tank in the color black and this cost $11 or I paid $11 this one is in a size extra large and the dress was in a 1x if I forgot to mention I do apologize I keep forgetting to mention because the sizes are not listed on the like invoice so I'm just completely forgetting to mention stuff but anyway everything will be list listed down below if you guys are interested so again this is the same tank as before it is in the black color with the faux buttons in the center and it is v-neck this one is also cropped both of them fit the exact same I would say in my opinion and they're definitely consistent in that way and then the last like clothing item that I got 
was a pair of pants. These are the plus red floral print paper bag waist. They're in the color white combo and they cost, and, and I paid $10.58. So I will be honest with you guys, these pants are definitely my least favorite out of everything I tried on. They look super cute, but they just didn't fit me well. And these are also in a size 1X. So this is what the pants look like here. They are so cute. Look at that really pretty pattern. It's like this like burnt orange with the pinks and the reds with the florals it is so cute it does have a tie and it does also have a paper bag waist like the white jeans there are pockets in these pants but they're smaller if that makes sense so they're not very deep um i mean it's still nice to have pockets so i'm not really complaining and then these are just a pair of flowy pants super comfy you know who doesn't love these pants? They're just perfect to wear to work. You just feel like you're in PJs and I love it. Um, I will say with these type of pants, I have not found a pair at all that have worked really well for me. All of the ones that I've tried on, on have been too short at the bottom. And so I just haven't found my perfect pair. If you guys know, where I can find these flowy pants in a size long, please let me know. I liked the ones from Torrid, but unfortunately they don't carry long. So um, if you guys have any other suggestions, be sure to let me know. But the issue with these, not only the length is a little too short, but also I almost want to suggest sizing up in these pants because they're not actually high waisted. They're fit more like a mid rise, but typically with the paper bag waist, you want it to go up higher. So I feel like you should size up. It also was just clinging to my hip area, just making me look even and wider so these are just they're definitely going back for me I love the pattern I love the idea of these pants but I just can't justify like I'm never gonna wear them unfortunately just due to the sizing issue and lastly I just picked up some little bralettes I mentioned before I believe it was in my last Rue 21 haul I love Rue 21's bralettes they are always so incredibly cute and they do carry plus sizes if you guys are interested so the first one I got was the the first one I got is the plus black floral lace v-neck back and I paid $8.25 for this one. I have already worn it and I'm not going to try these on for you guys. I do apologize, but they are a little too sheer for me to show, but I'll have them listed down below. I believe the models have them on so you guys can check the website, but this is what the first one looks like. It does have this super deep V in the front. Like I said, really sheer. There's no cups or anything in here, so it's just pretty much it. Um, you do get some support though, since you have that deeper V, it kind of like pushes them up in the middle in my opinion. And then we do have some lace at the bottom really, really cute. This one is not like adjustable or anything like that, but I thought it fit really great. And then, like I said, the items were buy one, get one half off. So I just grabbed another one as well. This one is the plus ivory Daisy lace V-neck long line in the color ivory. And this is and this one cost, and this, and, and I paid $8.23 for this one. So this one is a little different than the black one I shared with you guys. I thought I got two of the same, but I guess not. So this one is more off white. Um, it is also, it does also have the deep V in the front, but this one has a lot more materials. You guys can see it's a little bit thicker at the bottom. And this one does actually have cups in it. Um, I will say, <laughs> I don't love the way the cups were making me look. Like I just felt kind of like uncomfortable in this one. Um, like I said, I have a ton of different ones from Rue 21 and they usually all fit me really great. But for some reason, this one was a little bit tighter. So maybe sizing up in this one might be a good idea. I think it has something to do with the length of the straps. At least that's what it felt like. But it might also be due to the cup. So I'll take the cups out and I'll keep you guys posted down below um, and see how it fits. But I love bralettes for like everyday wear. Um, I hate wearing a normal bra so these are really great especially with the summer time coming up you guys could easily wear something like this that has so much good coverage with like one of those skirts or with the pants even and it would be so incredibly cute so that was actually everything I had to share with you guys from Rio 21. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you guys haven't already and check out my Instagram. I'll have it listed in the description box down below. I will also have all of the items listed in the description box down below and including a link to shop in my size in case you guys are interested. 
please consider subscribing if you guys haven't already. I am so incredibly close to hitting 10,000 subscribers, so thank you guys all so, so much. I would love, love, love to hit 10,000 by my birthday, which is May 6th, so we're coming very soon, and I think we can totally do it. So if you guys haven't already, please consider subscribing so I can reach that goal. Um, let me know in the comments down below what you guys thought of all these pieces I had to share with you guys. Do you enjoy shopping at Rue 21? Do you guys have one close to you? What are your thoughts on Rue 21? Definitely let me know in the comments below, and let me know what your favorite piece was that I shared with you guys today. Let me know also in the comments below if you guys have anything you would like me to talk about and discuss during my microblading appointment and my video um, be sure to let me know down below so I can answer any questions that you guys might have and check out for that video again it should be coming in the next week or so but you guys I think that's actually gonna do it for today's video so thank you guys all so so much for watching I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you guys in my next one bye guys <laughs>